There is a growing concern among the Thornhill Muslim community following a troubling incident at an Islamic center. Tonight, many are worried about a recent rise in threats and harassment, all stemming from events thousands of kilometers away. CTV's John Musselman explains. Congregants at the Amman Mahdi Islamic Center in Thornhill say the attacks are frightening. This, this anxiety and level of fear is something unusual. I haven't observed anything during, you know, all those 30 years attending mosque and uh, Islamic centers. Three exterior walls of the Islamic Center were spray painted with derogatory, hateful graffiti. It has since been painted over. It included the words death to priests and death to the Islamic regime. The mosque has also been targeted with online threats and demonstrations. Congregants say the protesters are drawing false connections between the mosque and the government of Iran. It comes in the wake of protests for women's rights and freedoms in Iran, spurred by the death of a 22-year-old woman in police custody. These disgusting threats and actions have no place in Canada. An entire community and religion shouldn't be demonized in this way due to the actions of some people across the world. Zero affiliation with no government, with no political parties or anything. Uh, this is just a, a place of worship. York Regional Police have released security camera photo of a suspect. His face is covered, so there's not much to go on, but someone may recognize the clothing. It happened around 11.45 p.m. on October the 13th. So it's being classified as uh, hate motivated, hate bias. So anytime there's a, a criminal offense that occurs that is uh, hate motivated or has bias attached to that, uh, we have a hate crime prevention unit that will investigate. So far, no arrests. The Islamic Center is equipped with security cameras. Staff say extra security will be added as a precaution. If you have any information, you're asked to call York Regional Police. John Musselman, CTV News in Thornhill.